आवाज़ ना वो रेश में सकता है देना मने नली रेश में सकता है दे ना ये दिन नले ये नो मरता है दिला ना ना तरह अधिके वीट कोटो वीट याव टाइम में ली वीट कोड बेको याव टाइम में ली कोल्ड ईयर बेको उन्हें बोलते हैं ना उड़ी उड़ा सकता है रो वंदा अनुमाव दे दे ना वो ये मगु के आतरा मार दे इतरा मगु नम्बे इधर आगते दे ना उन्हें � अदरली नमगी इधर कुत्ते नो ये उड़ो सागो तरली नमगो अंसल पा अनुभव आये थला इतरा मार्दर मार्द तरली अदरली नमगो अंसल पा अनकुल आग बोले ना अंतर बुटो नान नम विशेष के लिए और आधे तरह मार्दे दरो सा मार्दे दान अंतर नमगे मगो अंसल पा आरोग्य तरह कांडस्तो नमगे फर्स्ट वन और टू आवर्स ऑफ लाइफ और Equally important is the maintenance of the body temperature. Unless the body temperature is maintained, whatever calories we give to the child, whatever food we give to the child, goes only for maintaining the temperature of the body, not for the growth of the baby. This is especially true in low birth weight babies and in premature babies. Plus, hypothermia per se is quite dangerous even to the life because it can cause other tissue, other metabolic problems like tissue hypoxia, neurological problems, low blood sugar and even death. Imagine being flung into ice cold water. That's the same level of thermal shock that a newborn baby feels at uh, room temperature. And these are babies therefore struggling for survival soon after birth. And these are the babies that we are trying to help through our infant warmer. In the tribal uh, communities in uh, which we live, uh, the mothers are very young and they, I have not seen any very specific practice of keeping the baby warm. Maybe they'll keep them very close to the uh, fire, the mother, uh, the whatever, stove or something. But as such, they'll just wrap the baby nicely with whatever available clothes they have. <laughs> अवाग बाटे ना शेयर का मारी मोगो गोती पलगस्ती में येरे ने दो येरे काले सी मोगो बेच गिरे के येरे काले सी ऐ लेने ने चिते में मूर ने दो ना मोगो बेच गिरे के बाटे आ के स्पेट रह के साख साखे पलगस्ती में कटन बाटे उसे नमके फर्स्ट मूर्जना मकलाई तो आदरले मध्यले मगो डिलवरी आगे येर दिसा ही तो सर ना आद ये ना तो अंता नमके को तला फर्स्ट डिलवरी ना आना वो आस्पेलल ले डिलवरी आई तो ना लागी तस्ना येर ने मगो आगे तस्ना आदेन आगे तो अंता नमके को तला उन सर पम मगो कई काल लेने इल्लो ओलगडे ने गर्भकोष्ठो Ibu guru ini kalau nak itu resmi berada sah bagi kau nelayan di kelab posyuk ni mati lah orang. Amerika ni lah itu mati mati lah. Ada remogu ke sulpa Amerika ni berada sulpa belai itu bisi berat lah ini ada rumah dari antara ni. Awan cikgu di sini rumah itu ada ni lah cikgu di rumah. Kelab full pack up mati tu ada ni remogu na cendang bateri ni lah cover mati. Amele awan tu box type itu na mele waste tu box itu ada mele itu putu bulpa kadar full. Nana alai deh pakar bulpa ku. Al kurik kontrol itu, amat ya balap agak keluar, nama zaman tu, mago ya gitu ya gitu. Kadai ini mardar ini bagai, ini taraf mardar kalau, alai kalau kadai ini bagai 35 kilometer berbek na city ke, berbek orang aspek tu orang sebek orang awo, awal na bercerita itu current level ada berbek orang dengar, tumbuh kasih no kerja kat yang tapa pelajar jenah tumbuh berdoor jasti. Awal ke na gitu dengar, yo alai alai ada berbek aspek tu dah kota, yo istri berbek orang tanpa awal ke esen itu sahaja, aduh bapa friend mardar eh, tanggung deh bagala, mana na late kondo, noda na antar mudi taraf mardar eh. इधर हमारे मक्कलों ना कड़कों ला संभव नहीं रहते। We've known for over a hundred years that keeping babies warm 
increases their chance of survival and growing up healthy. But uh, most babies in the world don't get the benefit of this knowledge. Um, we have technologies today that actually do this. They're called incubators. They're essentially glass boxes that plug in and keep babies warm. Unfortunately, those exist in develop, developed countries or they exist in hospitals in urban areas. Uh, populations in developing countries that live in rural areas don't benefit from this. We are trying to use uh, technology to bridge that gap and see can we innovate to meet the needs of uh, the large swaths of masses that live in uh, the countryside that can benefit from the century old knowledge that we have. I personally have traveled through 13 states in the country talking to moms, midwives, uh, doctors, shopkeepers, understanding the rural context, understanding what they do with infant care right now, whether they understand the importance of keeping babies warm, who makes decisions, uh, how do products get to these places and so on. And we try to design the product to fit into the local context. After the conduct of the clinical study where we found that the device was safe because there was no incidence of adverse events or serious adverse event, the feedback from the doctors, that's the caregivers and the parents of the babies who were involved in the study, since they were good, we understood that the device is safe, it's effective and it meets its purpose. So we have two versions of the warmer, one that can be used in a clinic setting for warming the baby within the clinic or for transporting the baby to a higher level center where it can get better care. This works off electricity. We have a second version that can be used in a home setting and that can actually work off boiling water. So basically the transport device comprises of uh, three components, the heater, the warm pack and the baby wrap. So the heater, it heats the warm pack. The warm pack reaches the right temperature and regulates the temperature for n number of hours. So the idea was it should be something modular, small, lightweight. The warm pack is basically uh, the inspiration taken from how the baby feels in the womb, which does two things. It regulates the temperature of the wax as it gets transferred to the baby, and the baby gets the same temperature throughout as it's lying on it. So it doesn't get more temperature somewhere. And what it does is the other feeling it gives to the baby is it's still in the womb because the womb is watery and it's fluid. So the baby feels that, you know, he's somewhere in his own space. He doesn't feel that he's in a device or he's just some of somewhere away from the mother. The baby wrap is a very comfortable environment created for the baby. The moment you place the warm pack in the baby wrap and place the baby in, it's a nice warm swaddle and the mother can easily lift the baby and hold the baby. Embrace's product is simple, clean and intuitive because of the user being involved in the process. We don't want it to be looked like as an antibiotic that we're giving. Like, oh my God, your child is really unhealthy, take it. But it should be a vitamin. I'm giving the best care possible to my child. We generally transport the baby by wrapping the child in cotton or sometimes even in aluminum foil sometimes they keep the wrap the child and put the put the baby in a box containing sawdust but in spite of all this many a times when the child gets into the ICU the child is found to have hypothermia now munde inde ella athara baby refer madbekadre blanket athara ella use maadi avaru parents sariyagi adanna maintain madadale idre Temperature maintain मरा तो कष्ट आती तो ये तरह embrace बा embrace चली ना वो wrap मारी कुट्रे baby temperature correct टाइम maintain मर बोलो इधर अंदर positive I initially went to hospitals looked at NICUs and what I felt was mothers were standing outside. Uh, an IC which had glass and they were just looking at their babies and that is what is one of the most worst feelings that you get that your baby is just two day old and you're just standing outside you can't even hold him touch him so what this product does is you have your baby in your hand 
and the baby is wrapped and it's a cozy environment when you look at that site itself you feel that the baby is safe it gives you a sign of hope right from day one at embrace we've tried to actually design our products to complement kmc uh, in a hospital setting the embrace warmer enables babies to be brought to their mothers sooner uh, thereby not separating babies from uh, mothers through radiant warmers or incubators uh, also in a home setting we ventured that it provides easy access and therefore when a mother needs uh, to take a break from providing kmc to tend to her chores the baby does not get cold and rather can uh, be placed in an embrace warmer in addition we are also uh, we are also ensuring that awareness of kmc increases through our instruction manuals and training programs the hope is that uh, every mother or a doctor who uses an embrace warmer will also get to learn about kmc and its benefits in rural india especially the even today the antenatal care the prenatal care and the postnatal care are still wanting a lot of people have difficulty in access difficulty in affording those things and many times appropriate care is also a question mark in there and even if you look at the spread of the public health care delivery system we have a lot of primary health care centers but most of them are ill equipped and our infrastructure also in terms of major issues like electricity transport these are really bothering the community in terms of accessing appropriate health care at appropriate time and these baby warmers in, which are actually adapting to the local needs is something very very critical for such kind of there is a dire need for more innovation in public health because these are some of the biggest challenges facing our times and possible ways by which we could encourage this are one success needs willingness to fail and so as a community we should be willing to take on more risk without uh, putting patients at risk we should also enable small successes and this can happen through more decentralized decision making uh, a possible avenue is more public private partnerships okay uh, encouraging a robust private segment so that doctors can individually make decisions on uh, ad uh, on adopting innovative products we constantly keep getting demand from uh, other countries ranging from peru to palestine to philippines we can't wait to get it, get this out to the babies who need it the most and so we are trying to partner with people who are well equipped to do that um, this includes uh, folks like ge and novartis who are who have wide distribution and therefore can help us scale quickly we fundamentally believe that choice is a good thing and providing people choice enables them to choose their destinies today when a low birth weight baby is born and when the baby is sick the mother is left helpless often to take care of her child and we are trying to provide an option by which the mother can take better control of her life and provide care to her baby no baby should have to live its first few days of life without the warm embrace of its mother